Hello, this is A.D. Ramsey of DaVita Handcraft Soap. So I have my oil separated because this is a very simple design, but I want this fragrance this color. And if you're not a fan of, of uh, lavender, because I'm not, this right here by Brambleberry, and I just used the last of it, it's called um, Black Amber and la um and and uh what did I just say? Black Amber, why don't you read it? <laughs> and lavender. <laughs> Black Amber and Lavender. Okay, so this it's amazing. It does to me lean a little masculine, but I don't know, I love it. I just think I like amber, so I think that's the bomb. So I don't have any more of that. I'm trying to work through all of my fragrances. I'm not buying any more until I get rid of the amount of fragrance I have. It's, it's pretty horrible. So I'm going to mix my Lime Water Solution in this container with some um, Activative Charcoal. Okay. And that's because I'm going to put the majority of the fragrance in this container, which will go on the bottom of my <laughs> of my soap mode. I know I'm I'm sounding like I'm trying to convince myself first, huh? All right, you know what? Let me start physically doing this. So this part of the sodium hydroxide does not have any TD in it, titanium. So this is just this, the fragrance, and the sodium hydroxide was mixed with whole milk. I'm trying to get all my whole milk soaps that I'm doing this year. I'm going to do those first. In my head, I'll probably just jump around. Okay, so that goes there with a little bit of activated charcoal. Ooh, this smells so good. All right, so I'll set this off to the side. And blend this. Push it down in there so it doesn't make a poof. A big poof, I should say. Okay. This thing is so powerful. Eee. Cannot wait to use this on some hot process soap because this stick blender is no joke. I guess I could have had a spatula. And right now this looks very gray, but like I said, this fragrance oil, which I have used before, um, darkens to a very dark color. Ooh. So I'm going to because of that essential oil in there loosens up the batter. Okay. So we're going to pour this in first. Should I pour all of it in? I don't think I will. I don't know. Maybe I will. I'm not going to pour all of it in. I'm just going to pour this much of it in. What are you doing, lady? Okay, okay, okay. So I'm going to tap this down. 
Okay. Okay, now I'm going to take, set this off to the side. Man, this is really thin. Ooh, oh, wait a minute. Let me double check this. Because that is very, very thin. It's not separating, is it? I want to get a little false trace going on here. That would be a first. Okay. Get it together. All right. We're good. We're good. But this looks weird. Oh, brother. It looks weird, so I guess that's part of the course. And now we're going to take this portion and mix it in. This milk has a little TD in here. Might need to put a little more. Let's see what it looks like first. Ah! After I clean this. Okay. here because I've never poured a soap into this mold and I don't know why does it look like that oh oh never mind <laughs> did I bang it and it slid or something I don't know I don't know and in this container this is a little bit of active charcoal. I'm going to pour a little bit of this in here. Not a lot, just a little bit. Okay. Okay. And then, why am I acting like I only have one spatula? Sheesh. Uh, and this also has the fragrance in, in the... Um, Activator charcoal. That's why I was liquid tea. Oh man. I'm very curious now. This is. I don't know. <laughs> color is nice. I think between the milk solids, the TD, I don't know. Okay. Look what I found! Ta -da! Okay, so. <laughs> to give this a little stir. Oh, that is nice. Give this a little stir. That is super runny. I don't know. You're, I'm questioning you. Oh, yeah. This looks good. All right. I was on the fence. You scared me for a minute there. Okay, so we're going to, what are we going to do? Why am I acting like this isn't a remake? 
So now this time, I'm not going to put, okay, forget it. Finish talking about it. Let's be about it. These two grays. This is the one that has the fragrance oil. So it's going to automatically turn this a little more creamy. It won't be um, this off-white color. And this also has a fragrance oil in it. Maybe I'll plop this on the top or use it for samples. How about that? Just a little cut, cut, cut. And take the spoon. Oh, this is a lot of soap. And I'm not down far enough. Ooh. Okay. Since this is so fluid, that to the side this is going to be samples and put a little plop on top since you're still fluid pour you down the center okay oh that color is so pretty too bad it won't stay that color look at that gray it's probably not picking up never mind Now, the swirl or the technique that I very rarely do is a hanger swirl. Because when I tell you guys, oh my goodness, I have never had a successful one. Is that successful? 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 <laughs> How do you say it? Successful? No. I... I'm horrible with that. Ooh, I want to dip that in there so bad. But I'm not. Ooh, but I am. How about tapping down? Man, I, that's why I need to soak with an audience. So I have questions. I love this mode. Ah, oh, Lordy, Lordy Beasley. Ooh, did y'all have a miss? <laughs> I know I'm always going back down memory lane, but did you all have a Miss Beasley doll? <laughs> oh man, I had a Miss Beasley doll. I had a Miss Beasley doll. I had a Raggedy Andy and my brother, I mean Ann, and my brother had a Raggedy Andy doll. And, um, Okay, y'all. Don't think that I'm crazy. But this is a true story. My brother and I, we never were about 22 months apart. If that. Yeah, 20, yeah, 22 months apart. My brother and I have never ever gotten to a fist fight. My father was very laid back. He, you know, easy going. But he was not playing that fast physical shenanigans in our house. It just, he didn't grow up around violence and he was not having any violence in his house. Period. Period. So one day, my brother <laughs> made me so mad. We were little, little kid, children. Young children. And I went and got the scissors and I cut off all of the clothes to his to his raggedy end. <laughs> and I took 
with the shoelaces and I cut them up and I cut off his hair. I took his hat and I, I just <laughs> cut them all up. My brother and what made me never do that again to hurt my He was so just hurt and distraught and I was the cause of it. I never ever did anything crappy like that to my brother again in life. And I will be, he he just turned 50 this year. Well, no, 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 no. He'll be 51 in March. And I have never, ever done anything shady again to my brother. That hurt me. Ugh. I could cry just thinking about it. So shout out to the younger siblings who had to endure the wrath of the elders. But I tell you what, I wouldn't trade my brother for the world. He is something else. Um, he's a painter. And uh, he does contract painting. He's, he's a mess. <laughs> Maybe every soap uh, video I'll tell us a brother a, a story about my brother because baby I got a million of them. He's a mess, I tell you. All right, so we're going to wait for that to harden up, and I'll do a little swirly swirl or something, and I'll bring it right back. Okay, so this is what it looks like. And I was able to make a few samples, two, four, six samples, and <laughs> myself a bar. Like I said, this is one of my favorites, so I made myself a bar since I don't have, this is a remake, and um, I, I don't cut the end pieces off, I just sell it, so someone gets a bonus bar when they get the end. So we will come back on tomorrow and slice it up. See you then. <laughs> All right, it's the next day and we are ready for the cutting. And I'll have to show another picture once this um, soap discolors. Okay, yeah. Eh. I am very interested because all of this is going to discolor. Even though this gray is lighter, I'm just, it's going to turn black. I don't know. We will see. Ooh, nice big chunky end pieces in the back. And I don't shave it. That's just the way T.I. is. Uh oh. <laughs> Take one more slice. See, I'm, I shouldn't have put this on top. The, I did use some of this to make the sample. But then again, this is going to get dark, this is going to get dark, and this is going to get dark. I don't know. Guessing game. But this smell, this is it. I made myself, where's my little bar? So I made myself my own little bar. Do you guys make your own soap? I made a disaster soap. But it smells so good and it has a ton of um, avocado oil. So I don't know if I'm going to rebatch it or... Just leave it for me. Mm. Wow. Like it. All right. So this is A.D. Ramsey of DeVita Handcraft Soap. Thank you for stopping by. And have a great day. Or night. Bye.